welcome back. So today we're talking about sewing patterns for men. So if you've been a follower of my channel for any length of time, you'll know that now and again I do a free patterns video, but I've never done one for men. And I do now and again get questions asking about men's patterns. So I thought today would be a great opportunity to do that this video will be great if you're one of the few men that follows my channel but even if you're not this is a great video to find patterns for your husband your brother your son your uncle your friend anyone who is male because there's just not many patterns out there for men so without further ado let's get into it so at this time of year in the northern hemisphere it's the middle of winter and what better time to sew up an undershirt either for yourself or your loved ones so fred fury which are known for their men's patterns they have some wonderful patterns and i can vouch for them myself having sewn up a few of them they've got this wonderful undershirt what well, they call it an undershirt basically it's a tank top for men so in the winter, as it is now, you could wear it under a shirt or in the summer, you could wear it as like a singlet, as a tank top, if you will. There's a couple of great things about this pattern. Firstly, I love the shape of it, but I also love that this doesn't take much fabric at all. If you've got a light to medium weight knit fabric, a rib fabric would do nicely on this then you could sew it up. And I think if you've got a wide fabric, you could make it in probably about a meter of fabric. So the next pattern you could wear over your undershirt, and that is a classic shirt for men. And that's by freesewing.org. The great thing about this website is you go in and you put in the measurements. So that can be a little bit difficult if you're sewing for a gift, but if you are sewing this for yourself, or maybe your husband or son you should have their measurements and you can input them and then you can make it up and you get the pattern specific for the shape of the person that you're sewing it which is absolutely fantastic i have sewn something from this site and i can vouch for them they are pretty good it's my preference on men's sewing patterns if they're a little bit form fitting so they do come in at the waist and give some sort of shape really depends on the person wearing them if they prefer oversized then in this case you might want to size up a little bit or put in larger measurements for the waist but as i say this is a form fitting shirt it has fisheye darts in the back which give that lovely shape the darts in the back will bring it in at the sides so that will just give a gorgeous shape it's got all the features you would expect to see in a classic shirt it's got the placket it's got the cuffs it's got the collar the collar stand etc this is a great pattern for your first shirt to really get to grips with it and best of all this is a shirt that can be worn in multiple occasions whether it's for going to the office whether it is to go to a party, depending on the person wearing it, they might want to just wear it down the pub, you know, pre-COVID times, or just at home. It really depends, but there is so much versatility in this pattern. So my good friend Elisa over at Thoughtful Creativity is also releasing a video today she is also going to be talking about free men's sewing patterns and the patterns she's talking about are ones that i'm not discussing so after this video is finished do go over and check out her channel i know you'll love it there will be a link in the end cards and down in the description below so my next free sewing pattern for men is perhaps my favorite one in all of this list and that is a basic tee from LB Textiles. It has a shape that suggests a real high quality garment and I could see myself making lots of these. In fact, I'm going to download this pattern today because I did mention a free pattern by this company before and they took it down shortly after my video. So if you're seeing this video straight away, do go and check and download that pattern now. So this t-shirt is a basic relaxed fit. It has a crew neck, it has short sleeves, it comes to your upper hip i would say and it is just a basic tee there's not much else to say about it but i just really love it and who doesn't need a basic t-shirt in their life so this next pattern won't appeal to everyone but if you want to look dapper or you want your loved ones to look dapper then this is one to consider and that is a flat cap 
So this flat cap sewing pattern is also from freesewing.org. So you do put in measurements, but there's no fitting as such because it's just a cap that sits on the top of the head. I think this will be a fairly simple sew. I think a beginner could do this. Actually, I think a beginner could do most of these patterns. You probably would want a little bit of experience to do the shirt, but overall you could do any of them. The flat cap pattern is going to be a scrap buster. You're going to need very small amounts of fabric for this. And you'll probably want a bit of interfacing for the peak, for the cap peak as well. Oh, I love it. I think it looks so dapper. Maybe I'm showing my age here. If you're liking this content so far, do hit that subscribe button. Give me a like and leave a comment down below. Those things tell YouTube that my video is great and they'll share it out to more people. So the fifth pattern to share with you is a classic necktie. Show me a man that doesn't need a necktie in their life. Even if they're not a wearer of neckties, generally there's always going to be situations where they need to look smart and this pattern will do that trick. I bought a necktie pattern years ago from Made Every Day Dana. She has a pattern that you pay for and I purchased that and did make it up. So I can tell you that neckties are super easy to make. You cut them on the bias so that they stretch around the neck and they don't take up much fabric. You probably could get away with a meter of fabric. You cut it in a similar way to the way you would cut bias binding fabric. Now, if you want to get this free pattern, you will need to sign up to their newsletter, but it's super simple to do that. So if you've got someone in your life that does like to wear ties, then this would be a fantastic pattern. Depending on the fabric you use, you could make it look really, really smart. I would love to make this pattern in a silk. Imagine that, a silk tie that you could gift to someone for either Christmas, their birthday, Valentine's or any other gift or just to say you appreciate them. That would be fantastic. So the next pattern is a little bit more relaxed and that is a man's hoodie. Who doesn't need a hoodie in their life? I know I love them. Hoodies are so comfortable. They're great if you're working from home in these new times or even if you want to walk the dog. Or So this pattern is by Lakala, and Lakala is similar to free sewing in that you input your measurements. So once you input those measurements, you get a pattern that is perfect for your body or the person you're sewing's body. And I just think that takes a lot of the work out of the whole process of fitting. So this pattern has all the typical features of a hoodie, a hood, obviously. It has kangaroo pockets. It does have a zip down the front. So it's more of a cardigan than a jumper hoodie. But if you wanted it as a jumper hoodie, just don't put the zip in and cut it on the center fold, remembering to remove the seam allowance. We seem to be getting progressively more relaxed as these patterns go on and this final pattern is as relaxed as it gets and that is PJ Bottoms from Five Out of Four Club. So these are actually a unisex pattern so they can work for women or men so you could make them up for anyone. They look to be a great pattern, there's lots of options so you can have a low rise or you can have a high rise. There's lots of different lengths of legs, so you can wear them as shorts or bermudas or even long trousers or pants. You could actually have these as pyjamas. They come with a drawstring or an elasticated waist. You could wear them as house clothes as well or even casual clothes. PJ bottoms seem to be a really great gift that you can give to your loved ones. So my list is typically shorter than my other free pattern videos and that's just because there are not as many patterns out there for men, especially free ones. However, I have found a nice selection there and I hope you can appreciate them. Do leave me a comment down below and let me know which of these patterns you want to sew up or if you have any patterns that I haven't mentioned then do let us know about those as well. So now you've watched my video, head over to Elisa's video at Thoughtful Creativity. There's a link here. She has more men's sewing patterns that I haven't mentioned today and they're all free. Until next time, happy sewing. Bye for now.